How to install Oxygen OS 11 based on Android 11 from the OnePlus 7 on the POCO F1. Hey peeps, what's up? Manji here, back with another video. And in this video, I'm going to show you how you can install Oxygen OS 11 from the oneplus 7 based on android 11 on the xiaomi poco f1 now what are the prerequisites for this video well for starters you do need to have an unlocked bootloader and then you also need to have a custom recovery installed next thing you need is for your device to be decrypted again you need your device to be decrypted and how do you find out whether your device is decrypted or not so if you are running a rom which is based on miui you can go into settings and then you will go into password and security and then you can go into privacy here it is you can see this device here is encrypted but if your device is decrypted it is going to say phone not encrypted now if you are on a custom rom which is based on aosp what do you do then then you can go into settings and then once you're in settings you can go into security and tap on advanced if you do not see the option so here it is encryption and credentials shows this device is not encrypted so let me repeat it for one last time your device does need to be decrypted if your device is not decrypted then you will have to decrypt it first and videos for all of these can be found in the description of this video next up what are the files which you need now all the files which you need are linked in the description of the video so first up you do need the twrp recovery by oof gang and no you cannot do this without installing twrp by oof gang next up you need the oxygen os build itself this is oxygen os 11 never gonna give you up build and the last thing you need is the firmware file for the POCO F1 and links to all of these can be found in the description of the video and no you do not need disable force encryption also make sure your battery is charged at least 50 to 60 percent do not and I repeat do not do this process if your battery is at 20 or 30 percent another warning make sure you have a backup of all your pictures videos anything important which you have on your device because you are installing a custom rom on your phone and if you run into any issues boot loops encryption issues you will have to perform a format data in which case you are going to lose all your pictures videos and anything important which you have on your device and one last thing the steps will remain the same even if you are on a custom rom which is based on aosp you just have to skip the steps which are not applicable to you and let's say you have a rom which is based on aosp then you won't have the option of removing your mi account so here we are and we do have the poco f1 running miui 12 based on android 10. now first thing we need to do is you'll go into settings and then you'll go into password and security remove your screen lock fingerprint and face unlock once that is done go back go into me account and remove your me account once that is done go back go into accounts and sync and remove your google account now once you have removed all the accounts and security measures make sure you reboot your device once why are we removing all the accounts and security measures we're doing this because we're going from one rom to another and i don't want you to be locked out of your own device next up we do need to boot into twrp so first of all turn off your device once the device is turned off press and hold volume up and power button at the same time till you see the twrp recovery logo so here we are in twrp recovery and as you can see right now i have 3.5.1 the first thing we need to do is we need to switch over to twrp version 8 by oof gang so we will go into install and now you need to navigate to the folder where you have downloaded all the files in case you downloaded the files on your phone directly they will be in the download folder in case you transferred it elsewhere you would know where they are first file which you need to select is this one oof gang version 8 and then swipe to confirm flash now as you can see it is telling me that rebooting to recovery in 10 seconds so we don't have to do anything all you need to do is just wait and as you can see the device just rebooted and we should boot back into twrp now 
there it is we have booted into twrp and here in swipe to allow modifications and bam there it is version 8 twrp by oof gang next thing go into wipe advanced wipe select dalvik cache system vendor and data and then swipe to wipe once that is done we are going to tap on the home button and then go into install again navigate to the folder where you have downloaded all the files in my case it is in the download folder first file select the poco f1 firmware then add more zips next up select the oxygen os 11 never gonna give you up build and that's it swipe to confirm flash now once that is done we can scroll up and make sure there were no errors so here it is we are flashing the firmware and there were no errors then next up we are flashing the rom itself which is your oxygen os 11 everything was flashed without any issues over here as well so tap on the home button next up disable force encryption is not needed why because having a decrypted device was a prerequisite for this rom reboot and select system and there it is we do have the oxygen os boot animation on our poco f1 which means we are booting into the oxygen os 11 build and the first boot up will take some time so you have to be patient and there it is we are on the setup screen let me skip the initial setup real quick and there it is we have successfully skipped the setup let us go into settings about phone android version is 11 from the oneplus 7 device name of course is showing up as oneplus 7 and if you go into the version here it is security patch is from december 2020 the kernel they are using is shiva's no name kernel and here it is never gonna give you up popo forever build and there it is peeps that is how you install oxygen os 11 from the oneplus 7 on the poco f1 and that will do it for this video hope my video helped you likes shares and subscribes are appreciated feedback and comment more than welcome see you when i see you